De Canadese veteranen Jim Parks en Art Boone kregen een Maple Leaf bij hem om bij hem uit namen van Dokkum. De man wie in Dokkum om de twaalf vrouwtalig te bedenken. You recollect some things uh, fairly easy, other times you don't. Uh, if you're if you're among some of the boys and you recollect and you sort of inspire each other to talk, but sometimes on your own it's a you have to think back and uh, rebuild the memories, you know that sort of thing. They're there somewhere, and you drag them out. That's the way. It, that's the way it works. And unfortunately, some of our people now have dementia, so they can't remember some of it. And in a way, it might might be a bit of a help for them too, because some of those things you don't want to remember. The veteran finds it important to some of them to plant in. Because as the years go by, people remember you and they see your name on something like that, so they connect you with. With the liberation and everything, so I think it's important, you know, and, and it's important that the younger generation know what happened, you know, not just read it out of a book and forget about it, you know. And that's what we like to know that they know where their freedom comes from. It wasn't just given to you, you know, when you lose so many people during the war, and uh, and we don't know the exact numbers that are killed, but uh, and nobody really wins out of a war. In the end, when it's all over, yeah, we come out on top of it, but you don't win. Not when you lose all those lives, you know. It's a high price to pay for freedom. The two are a lot of the war in Ukraine. Putin would, he mentioned about use the use of nuclear weapons. Anyone with a, with a half a brain wouldn't be talking about nuclear weapons, because if you use them, we use them, that's the end of everything, you know. So common sense has to prevail somewhere in the, in the next little while. So we'll just wait and see what's happening. Take it up. One take. Up. Jim and Art wollen de jongere generatie graag wat mij aan. Look around, appreciate what they have. I mean, don't take it for granted. It's peaceful here. We have a, a well well organized. Uh, police departments and the councillors, so we want to keep it that way. It's democratic, we want to keep a democratic system going. We don't want to have anybody like Putin coming in here and, and say, hey, you can do what, I, do what I say. If you don't do what I say, we bury you tomorrow. Get a bit of peace around the world and stop the fighting and slow it down a little bit because it was going too fast anyway. It was as far as we're concerned.